firewalk with me? Welcome to Peppers and Glowworms, a channel dedicated to hot chili peppers and coldly glowing glowworms. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, chili pepper taste test Ahi Charipa F2, specimen 2B. You can see there has already been some fruit dropping. I'm a bit late with the harvest, but uh, this one berry still on the plant clearly shows that the fruits are standing upright and that they are ripened to red. Oh, and uh, there's another fruit that had dropped. But uh, let's leave them there for now and pick this one that's still on the plant. Oh, went off real easy. Was about to drop two, I guess. Let's taste this one. Nice and small, as I want them. Small fruited super hot chili pepper variety is my goal. Let's see. And off we go. So, there has been a heat warning issued for my local area. And I thought this is probably a sign from the great Capsicum Messiah or some other cryptic pepper pun that I should probably uh, finally get along with my chili pepper taste tests. There are some of them really overdue. I should finally perform them and uh, I think that's a good, um, a good opportunity to do so. And um, yeah, I will take a little walk outside to enjoy the summer I guess or maybe the, so that the neighbors will not be disturbed by my cries of pain and anguish hopefully uh, if the, my chili peppers are really nice and hot um, yeah um, uh, this is all for the bigger purpose of my chili pepper breeding project uh, where the goal is broadly speaking to produce a small fruited super hot chili pepper variety and um, I have three candidates planned for this walk. This video will be split in th uh, three parts, I guess, a little trilogy perhaps. And um, yeah, uh, one of them is uh, really promising, I think. But uh, we shall see. I hope my little wind noise reduction pusher uh, works well. Because it's also windy, which is nice when it's hot, but uh, also not nice if you want to record audio. But we shall see. And now uh, come along with me if you want. Uh, and I hope fire in the form of nice little capsaicin and capsaicinoids in my chili pepper fruits uh, will also uh, walk with me. So, let's go! Yeah, this body of water is the neuter. And there is a nice shady path where I can probably perform my first chili pepper taste test of this little walk. And of course in case of an heat emergency I can simply jump in the water. Yep. Okay, here we are with the first specimen to test. It is the first berry that I picked from the specimen 2B. Yep, right, 2B. Uh, from the Ahi Charipa breeding line, which is an Ahi Charapita crossed with a uh, Carolina Reaper chocolate. And this berry was uh, uh, definitely too long on the plant. It was harvested uh, too late. But uh, better now than Never bright. There was also a slight problem with uh, rips in the mini plantation, I guess. <laughs> hmm, I'm gonna... 
smell is a bit generic, I guess. Generic pepper smell. A bit more like an enum. Mm. Mm. That's just right. Already a bit leathery. <laughs> I didn't expect this. Oh. That's definitely hotter than the last one that I tested. <clears throat> wow. So the, the fruit was already a bit leathery outside because it was too long on the plant and couldn't detect much of a taste. A little bit of sweetness. Um, and maybe a tiny hint of bitterness. But basically, I just bit on it. Oh, it's a bit, a bit leathery, but not much taste. And then suddenly, boosh, a bunch of heat, which is now already dying down, still stinging a bit right there. But in the throat, it's tolerable mostly still located here in this area and I wonder what will happen when it really arrives in my stomach. I have prepared in the usual way by um, eating uh, lots of oats and fatty milk. Hmm. A pleasant surprise. Uh, this one definitely, that's the, the bare minimum of heat that I want from my chili pepper variety that I'm trying to breed. Something that just hits you and then it's over. That's, uh, yeah, that's basically what I want. I'm getting less and less um, um, megalomanic <laughs> in that sense. I don't want to uh, set any new records for heat or anything. I just want to have a small, tasty, bam, that's hot and gone, chili pepper. Yeah, and this one, <clears throat> in contrast to the last one I tested from a different plant, um, this one definitely went on the heat side. I'd say it's um, at least an eight, maybe, maybe a nine, between eight and nine. Mm. Let's say, let's say eight. Let's say a bit more conservative. And taste, um, huh, a five, five average. Uh, if there's no bad taste, um, but also no good taste, really, it's, it's average. It's just five. Yeah. So, Ahi Charapita. Damn it, I, I had to say it wrong one, once at least. Uh, the Ahi Charipa F2, specimen 2B. Yeah, nice heat, average taste, and this was part one of three. Now let's move on. Wait.